as the number of victims injured at the deadliest shooting in U.S. history continues to rise, a timely new report reveals firearm-related injuries cost America $2.8 billion a year in health care costs. The study from Johns Hopkins Medicine found that guns are now the third leading cause of death in the U.S., and unintentional injuries rose to 37.4% in 2014. With the average emergency room visit costing $5,200, it means American taxpayers are shelling out billions a year to account for firearms. The report, published today, comes as the nation faces yet another challenge to reach an agreement on gun control policies. For the study, researchers looked at the cases of more than 704,000 people who went to an emergency room following a firearm-related injury between 2006 and 2014. Nearly 90% of the patients were men, and about 50% were between ages 18 and 29. Researchers found that firearm injuries affected males nine times more than females. Almost 46 of every 100,000 males were injured during the years the researchers observed. This is compared to the five and a half females of every 100,000. The average amount of an emergency room charge is $5,254, whereas the amount for an inpatient stay was $95,887 on average. This totals approximately $2.8 billion spent on firearm-related injuries each year. Researcher Dr. Fais Ghani said that over half of the patients the researchers included in the study were either self-paying or uninsured. This means that either they pay for their treatment out of pocket or the hospital that treated them is uncompensated. And researchers also found that the number of ER visits resulting from firearm related injuries for people over 30 increased from 2006 to 2014. The study also concluded that patients injured by hunting rifles were more likely to have a mental health disorder. About 8% of the patients observed died in the emergency room or while receiving inpatient care as a result of a firearm-related injury, the study found. Dr. Ghani said, Until people are aware of the problem's full extent, we can't have the best informed discussions to guide policy. Of every 100,000 people in the U.S., 10.5 were killed by gun violence in 2014. This was compared to 16.3 of every 100,000 killed by poisoning and 10.6 of every 100,000 killed by car accidents. The amount that Americans pay for firearm related injuries is now about one tenth of the annual cost of heart failure.